Welcome to Arduino Programming and this is Ubeida Hassan Ubeid. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to copy and paste your Arduino sketch and use it on Proteus for project simulation. In this tutorial, I will simulate a simple project. Um, I will blink an LED on Proteus. So, first of all, you need to write down the sketch for your project. I mean, a sketch for blinking an LED. Uh, let us go through the sketch. Uh, in this first line over here, I've declared the pin number of uh, of the Arduino board uh, that I will connect to my LED. And then on the void setup, I just initialize the that pin as an output. And uh, on the void loop. Uh, since the the, the LED uh, will use the digital values, I mean high and the low. So uh, using the digital rights over here, I put a LED high for one second and then low for one second, and uh, this activity will run continuously. I mean repeatedly. The LED will turn on for say for one second and then off for one second. So before verifying your sketch, just go to the preference. Go to file, then preferences, and uh, put a tick on compilation. Then OK. After that, uh, verify your sketch. Just save it as link. And then uh, after verification, then uh, okay, it's done. It's good because uh, I see no error over here. So down the sketch book after compiling the sketch there are lines and the words will appear down below the IDE software. So just go and find uh, a file which uh, ends with ENO, I mean INO dot HEX, it is over here. And uh, copy this text from here to, sorry, Then just simply uh, control C. I think uh, I've copied it. So then go to the Proteus. Open your project. As you see, uh, this is the simple configuration uh, for blinking an LED. Just then double click uh, the Arduino board. You will see uh, there is a blank over here and uh, it is for program file. Then past that uh, text, uh, as you see the text uh, end up with uh, eno.hex, then say OK. After that just uh, run uh, the project. Okay. As you see over here, our uh, LED blinks after one second. It's on, then off, on, then off. So, thank you for watching the video. Uh, if you need some more tutorials about Arduino programming, just subscribe to my channel and write down your comments so I could do more and more things about Arduino and uh, and the projects over here thank you for watching